Hello, and welcome to this demonstration of Entra Device Migration from Quest. To prepare for your upcoming migration, you'll need to create a bulk enrollment package using Windows Configuration Design, as well as an Entra ID join profile, which we'll cover in another video. First, we'll download the device agent. This is an MSI file that can be deployed however you deploy package software, either through group policy, SSCM, or Intune. We've switched over to our user's workstation so we can deploy the device migration agent manually. Typically, this is done via group policy by creating an installer package, but for the sake of this video, we're going to do it manually. The service URL and the authorization key are found within the device migration wizard. When we check in with our user's workstation and go to a file and then go to properties, if we look under security, we can see that this user only has access from their source account. After we run the reactal step, this user will have access from their target account as well. After our workflow is completed, we're going to go over to the hamburger menu and select devices and servers. In here, we're going to see devices in the ready state. These are the workstations that you've already deployed the agent to and have now checked in with the ODM server. The first thing we're going to do is set the target environment. We do this by selecting the workstation and then going down to the action bar and selecting set target environment. We click apply action, set the target environment, and click apply. Now that we've set the target environment, we're going to select our workstation and run the reactal step. When we check back in with our devices, we can see that the reactal process has been complete. And we can now see that the target user has permissions to this file. OK, now that our reactal step is complete, let's go ahead and migrate this machine. We select the machine, and then scroll down to Entra ID Cutover. Click Apply. This is where we give it the name of that Entra profile that we created. And now we're ready to migrate. OK, when we check back in with our workstation and we scroll over, we can see that our Entra ID cutover status is complete. Let's go check on our workstation. OK, now that the machine has come back from reboot, I'm going to log in. And everything is exactly the same the way I left it. I'm going to run this dsreg command. And you can see that this machine is now only Entra joined. This concludes our demonstration on Entra device migration from Quest. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.